<laughs> little side gig there. All right, uh, checking in this morning, uh, live view from Carbondale. Much colder. It's been quite a change over the last couple of days. Uh, live view there and uh, showing some of that camera bouncing in the wind. It is cold. It is blustery outside. Definitely a winter like feel as you step out the door this morning. Uh, with temperatures dipping back below freezing now across southern Illinois. We've got a few spots even into the upper 20s down to 29 in Sparta, 30 in Mount Vernon, 31 currently in Marion. Paducah at 34, Murray also at 34. So a little bit warmer into the Missouri Boot Hill in Northwest Tennessee. Now you factor in the wind. Check this out. Wind chills right now back uh, into the lower 20s and at times we've actually seen some wind chills back into the teens. So it is cold outside and uh, quite a change from where we were just two days ago. The cold weather sticks around through your Friday uh, this afternoon. It's going to take some time, but we will eventually see some sunshine, some low clouds though around to start the day. Kind of a gloomy gray sky to start the day. But uh, as we look ahead to the weekend, we'll turn the temperature right back around as we send it back up into the mid to upper 50s, especially by Sunday afternoon. The one downside to the warmer weather returning, the wind is also going to return back out of the south Saturday and Sunday and could be very uh, strong winds on Sunday afternoon. Enjoy the dry weather this weekend. Uh, of course, we need to kind of dry out after all the rain we've had around here, but uh, it looks like some more wet weather on the horizon, especially by the middle of next week. All that rain right now uh, making its way to the east coast. A lot of quiet weather taking hold across the uh, central U.S. and the Midwest. Uh, notice the low clouds though, streaming straight out of the north. There is some lake effect snow uh, up in the northern and northwest parts of Indiana. That is, of course, going to stay well away from us. The clearing line just to our west right now, but a lot of those low clouds moving in from the north will be around, especially into southern Illinois and western Kentucky into even the early afternoon. It's about 3 o'clock, and I really think we'll start seeing some clearing, especially southwest Illinois. Much of southeast Missouri is likely to see mostly sunny skies by this afternoon. Temperatures, though, only going to top off into the mid to upper 30s today. It's going to be cold factor in the breeze. Wind chill stay in the upper 20s. We'll see skies clear out overnight tonight. Uh, notice as high pressure passes by the uh, streamlines there. We'll see winds back out of the south by Saturday morning. Saturday afternoon clouds increasing, but uh, with the south winds pushing temperatures back into the upper 40s, uh, about a degree or so above average. By Sunday, we're into the upper 50s, approaching 60 and staying fairly mild into the early part of next week. In fact, by next Tuesday, we're right back into the 60s as our next storm system tracks out of the desert southwest right across the plains at uh, southern track means no snow around here. Sorry, snow lovers. I know you guys have had it pretty tough this year, but we are going to bring more moisture out of the south and that means more wet weather showing up in our forecast. Dry this weekend, dry through Monday, but here comes the next chances for rain on the horizon by Tuesday, tracking a couple isolated showers. Wednesday uh, looks to be right now the wettest day of next week. Uh, could see quite a bit of wet weather and uh, Notice the warm temperatures there associated with that means another chance for possibly a few strong storms. Pretty quiet though this weekend. Uh, President's Day, maybe you got the day off school or the day off work. Temperatures into the mid 50s, not a bad uh, start to the week, but there's the wet weather by Wednesday and cooler weather making its return by the end of next week. Well, I'm looking forward to those 60s. Me too. All right.